Rosa's been stressed lately, and her friend told her about this cool meditation app. She's thinking about using it to find times to help her meditate daily. I know Google didn't develop this app, so if I share my Google account data with it, what does it get access to? The app gets your basic profile information, which is your profile photo, name, and email address. And if you choose, you can share additional kinds of data, such as your contacts, or, as this example demonstrates, Google Calendar. While Google warns you about some apps that could be risky, before you click Allow, think about if you're comfortable sharing data with this app, and what the app can do with your data. If you allow an app to view your data, the app may keep its own copy of the data you've shared. And also, be careful if an app is asking to write or manage your data. Because then, the app can act independently. It can change your Google data, like rescheduling or deleting events on your Google Calendar. I'm comfortable sharing data with this app. It's only asking to view my calendar data, not write or manage it, which makes sense because all I want it to do is suggest meditation breaks around my schedule. I'll allow it.